Okay guys, the chicken saga continues. So we all remember that we were going to go pick up chickens. Um, it actually took a couple more days because they didn't come in when we thought they were going to come in. So anyways, we got the cutest, they're called blue coaching, coaching chickens and they are so cute. The girl told me like, hey, sometimes these chickens get poop stuck in their butt. And I'm like, excuse me? <laughs> what? <laughs> and she goes, and when that happens, she goes, you gotta, you gotta help it out. You gotta get the poop out. I'm like, okay, that's not gonna happen. Yeah, yeah, it happened. Mm -hmm. So, it's Friday night, 10 o'clock. I'm like a nine o'clocker. I don't care what day of the week it is. <laughs> I go to bed between nine and 10, closer to nine. I'm old, I don't care. I get up at 4.30 in the morning. I want to go to bed but we got home from like some event and I, that makes my life sound really exciting by the way it isn't <laughs> it wasn't exciting but anyways 10 o'clock at night i check on these things and there's a little little turd nugget sticking out of this itty bitty days old chicken so guess what i had to do i had to warm up olive oil and rub olive oil on the little chicken's little butt. And my husband's like, what are you doing? And I'm like, I don't, I, the chicken is going to die if I don't do this. And he goes, yeah, yeah, it's a chicken. <gasps> Obviously not on the farm girl. Okay. I'm not a farm girl. I'm so upset that he would even suggest that we let this little chicken die. And you know what, you guys? That baby chick is still alive, thanks to me. So, if you are thinking of becoming a chick mom, because hello, who doesn't want chicks? I would first think about the fact that maybe, maybe you do not want to be, you know, pulling poop at 10 o'clock at night out of a chick's butt as you rub olive oil on it. Because it happens. Um, the, I don't know, they just, and yeah, you know, they die. Um, so, but if you can handle all that, you go be your bad chick mom self because um, these things are cute and floofy and fluffy. And I'm literally going with floofy and fluffy. Like I, that's, those are the names that have been sticking since before I even met them. Um, so help me out here if you guys have chicken names, okay? <laughs> Samson and I hope you guys have the best day.